So I want to quickly show you how to do a virtual machine recovery using the Cohesity software. From the main dashboard, click on Data Protection and then Recoveries. Click on Recovery on the right hand side. Click Virtual Machines and then VMs. From here you can search for your virtual machine. I'm going to use the asterisk because I don't have very many VMs. But you see the filters at the very top that you could go by the source type. We're going to select Web Server 2. On the right hand side you see the snapshot icon. Hit the pencil icon and select which snapshot if it wasn't the most recent you want to recover from. Then select recovery point. Next we're going to select recover options. So you have a couple different options. We go to the original location or new location. If you use original location it's going to expect to overwrite the VM or do something with the existing VM. For here we're going to tell it to keep it and it's going to mark it obsolete. If we did a new location, then we could rename the, the VM. Since we decided to keep the existing VM and overwrite it, I'm going to go ahead and attach the network and stay connected. If I was going to do a recovery to the same network with a different rename, then I would leave those off by default to avoid duplicate IPs. Now the recovery has started. Now as you see, instant recovery and data store migration. Instant recovery means it's going to use the Goesi hardware to instantly power on the VM and then we'll use VMware Storage Remotion to move it to the production data store. We see the VM recovery has completed. It took a little bit under three minutes depending on sizes and vMotion networks. Your mileage may vary on how long it takes in your environment. If we click on show subtask, you'll see more details about the VM recovery. Most important showing that we clone to a view. From the vCenter side, we see a VM with the underscore obsolete that's expected based on the selection we made for the VM recovery. And we also see Web Server 2 at the bottom, which is the VM that we recovered. I hope this was helpful and thanks for watching.